how did your five dollars ended up to zero and uh, how did your one thousand us dollar ended up to zero how did you blow all the money that you invested why did it happen that way is it because you don't know how to trade or because the market didn't respect you um the way you wanted it what could be the reason and why is it that each time you expected to go from this angle the thing you will see is that the thing is going up to this angle what could be the reason why am i always failing every time i plan to trade accurately why is it that the profit i had yesterday is no longer there today what could be the reason in this video i made it practically for you so that you'll be able to see one two three steps that will help you it's a very powerful strategy that will help you to fish out this simple in the uh, movement that will give you accurate position to see a downtrend or for you to see an uptrend do you see that that is what we are about to do in this very video we are working out on something uptrend like this and downtrend what are you going to say about it is it a joke or what how possible is this that one will place trade and later close it with profit this video is for you if that is what you are looking at for i will cover in this video how to see um how to see a reversal point that will help you to place your trade and how you can be able to watch out when this market is going to do a continuation or when this market is going to um, drop completely watch out in this video because it's going to be of help to you one thing you should have in mind is that any market that must drop or go up must be tested up to three times this is one thing you should know it will test it up to three times and when that happens then you will know that something is about to happen so because you have to draw your your you have to draw your trend lines you know you have to draw your trend lines to be able to ascertain the movement of the market you have to draw your horizontal line to be able to fish out the support and resistance zone these are simple things that you should have in mind so you need to find out when actually this market is going to break out from um, consolidation how will you be able to detect that please mark your mark something on your screen like this then because i'm going to help you out for you to fish out those things mark something like this then where are you going to be marking those things mark it at the end of all the previous support and resistance pick out the previous support and resistance which from this place now here is a resistance zone here is a resistance zone. I'm um, sorry. Here is a um, support zone. Here is a support zone. Why here is a resistance zone? Here is a resistance zone, and here is a resistance zone. Here is a support zone. So each time the market goes up like this and come down like this, goes up and step down, but it will not be able to cross what you have seen as a support zone. Which means every time the market will get to this point get to this point or get to this point it must definitely go back to it and if the market starts spiking and touch these very levels there is something that makes this thing not to be crossing this very level so that is why the market is getting a support that every time the buyers tried they get a support from the previous sellers and the market will stop there they will then sellers will push to this place and the market will resist the buyers will resist it and they will push the market back again they will now move down to this place again and they will they have one support here and another support here another support here they will come back again 
when they come back again they will now make a little move like this each time you see this that is why you should know your candle then the final one will push like this then if that one pushes again then know it that something is coming because from here you will notice that from this very angle here from here you will notice that the that sellers took more time than this ones than this previous one so as it happened here which means that sellers are trying to push more then you have to watch what you have on your windows that is the essence of adding up those indicators for you to fish it and then you have to check what you are using the moving average you are using or whatever you are using to ascertain the movement of the candle in your chart that is one thing you should consider because since it has broken out from here and never broke since it it it, it, um, it tried here and it didn't continue tried again it didn't continue tried again it didn't continue then get to this place and went back get here and went back get here and went back tried again and went back tried here and went back tried again here and went back tried again and back then but the drama that happened from this as this is longer than the one that took place from this place and these other places do you see that so based on that you will know that something is coming then you have to fix your eyes on these very um uh, windows so from here you have to think of what is happening from here then you watch that this thing will start touching the oversold level so if this thing is getting to this level which means that you will not see that this line that i've entered into into this level will not try to drop as this thing is not trying to drop is giving you a signal that sellers may be taking um more time than before which means that there is a momentum of sellers in the market than the previous places so why these things are going on if you don't know how to catch a spike to do this one or take a spike from this place or take a spike from this place please avoid the market if you don't know how to take one candle or two candles like this and leave the market please don't trade the market at this very point because it may be so so dangerous for you so remember where i started that once you have seen this that something is coming then watch your main uh, watch your window one you will notice that something is definitely coming up so if that is the case then you have to zoom out you have to zoom out to find out what the market may look like so let's just let's just do a little back test to see now watch this now watch this now watch this watch this you need to be very very careful in this i will show you you need to be very very careful this is one hour time frame this is one hour time frame please remember this each of this candle you are seeing here represent one hour candle so if you should calculate hours we have from here it will surprise you that this thing that you're seeing here must have taken days do you know why I, I want to mention this so that many of you should stop losing your trade in the hand of brokers and blame strategies get that from me my name is gdfx i love you and i want you to know the truth many of you should stop losing your trade in the hand your money in the hand of brokers thinking that they are manipulating the market nobody is manipulating the market that is no how this market will change because you feast your market in this place that is no how this market is going to change to um, upward direction because as you place for this thing to continue like this somebody placed to enter this place so how did they manipulate it who did they manipulate it for against you or in favor of the other person do they know who that person is no they don't have that time so each time you are seeing a market like this if you misbehave they will caution you through their agent and inform you of your misbehavior so that you will take take time but not that they will, they will watch your market and stop your market that's why if you place your trade for profit you will see the profit if the market is going against it against you you will see it but the problem here is that many don't have the accurate knowledge so watch this if you watch from here to this place this is a pure consolidation someone can trade like four candles four hours like here one two three four 
and that person will be successful that doesn't make you a good trader but it has made you a good sniper um i mean you enter you trade your sniper entry and you make this profit and you're out of the market but why am i saying this i want you to understand this but for you to trade and trade with more confidence you must discover what the market looks like that is one thing you should know then how possible is that when is this market going to reverse completely to be a bearish candle movement i mean that sellers are going to be on a great momentum yesterday uh, will i say yesterday or that about that i had a class with uh, i had a meeting with those who want to join on the challenge the 100 days to 1000 dollars challenge so this we are some of the questions people are asking me please i am making this video in respect of that question you asked and for those who are having these issues use this very strategy and thank me later now once you have seen this please mark your mark your this thing mark your line like this for you to ascertain a breakout if this thing should break out like this how then do you confirm it wait for one good candle to finish in your direction if that happen allow the next one to open look at it this thing tried in a horizontal line like this none break out below the same thing it never broke out here none 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 until here do you see that until this very point so this one that broke out here never continued then you have a that i mean you have something here that will tell you that this thing don't have any strength anymore because it has finished buying from here it has finished buying nothing is remaining here it has finished buying look at it it has finished buying it has touched the highest level that this place can think of so if that is the case which means that there is no need for you to hope that this thing will continue in this day. so entering for buy in this position is a suicide it's a suicide mission get this thing straight and you will understand this thing perfectly so entering this journey here is a suicide mission that this thing started going like this watch what you have below like this if this is the case which means that there is no opportunity for this to continue in this direction let's assume that it was a little bit from this angle which means it can be going at the center level like this to a point that it will i mean watch this thing it may be going like this to a point that it will touch here but this very one have touched this line completely which means anything that should happen here is for you to start going down like this do you get that now this is one clear thing you should get in mind so when this thing get to this point the journey started here no matter how you enter to catch a spike you can only catch a spike that would be like just uh, a little thing just a little thing like this pa pa then you are out of the market but it's very dangerous this market has completely formed uh, a bullish a uh, bearish candle movement so at this point this is what it means that the market has finally uh, breaking out from the place look at it this is what it means then how then would this strategy be of help to you you will not see a complete breakout and the lines in this place will not start having a space all this why you are seeing here none of them have space it will just be joining it will be like this it will be like this but at this point it will now have a space like this are you seeing it it will now have a space like this each time is coming closer the more closer it's becoming the more market is fighting to change direction this is how simple it, it will be or it looks like so that is how clear it is you can do this now let me show you one more thing that will help you in case you see it then you know that the journey is getting smoother and better for you now watch this i'm about to show you please remember to thank me after showing you this secret watch here watch here what happened this this do you see that now now look at the funny thing you can 
do your Skype, you can catch a spike, a very long spike. What you are seeing here is the that entered into this place. At this point, the market spiked and joined in this place. How do you confirm it? You will see one bold engulfing candle. Watch here. You also see one bold engulfing candle to show a clear reversal point. The problem I'm having with many is that they lack patience and discipline. They want market to respond to their belief. Let me tell you this. If you like, please, I don't mean to insult any religion or that, but please listen to me. If you like, place your tread and start praying. You'll be praying um, if you are this type that speak in tongues. You may be speaking in tongues and close your tread and only for you to shout the last word and see that your account is wiped out. Do you know that? You can call your whatever you believed. You can be calling on them. At the end of the day, you notice that what you place and believe that what you are praying for, what you are talking to, or the incantation, or the enchantment, or whatever you are using, will reverse the market. It will, it would, it will surprise you that you are already losing the trade. So it's not a, fa it's, it's not a religious something. Instead, it's a psychological something. So what you have in mind affects how you place your trade. Now watch this place. Look at it from the journey there, journey down here. Get that now and thank me later. Place your trade at this point. Place your trade at the breakout here. See, look at it. Close at this place, which is somewhere here. Just do that. It's okay for you. Then allow this thing to go to this place. Once you see once you see these trail lines, once you see these trail lines again, once you see these three things that will challenge the market, watch again. Immediately you see the line reversing again. Please, once you see this break and you see this board line again, you can hopefully, you can humbly place your trade here. Like you can allow this one to go, you place your trade from here, you close at this point which each of these candles represent one one hour. So if you are placing with uh, 50 cent, uh, 0 0.50 cent for those who have small account or those who have a huge account that can place with like $5, you know what it means that you cut this thing as a spike and you did a spike, a skyping that took you down to this place. You know what that means, that you are no longer joking. That is how simple this journey can be. I just showed you one. I just showed you one look at it do you see that you sell for sell so here now is your entry signal for sell here now is entry signal for sell why here is entry signal for buy at this point do you see that watch if it has failed it will not fail you once you see this line cross together below these 20 levels to 10 levels and once you see this below the 180 level 90 and 8 levels it has never fell and it will not fail you the problem here is can you be able to wait can you discipline yourself to manage this opportunity and thank me later and write on my comment section that is working look at it you can take a snipe entry look at it here it will not kill you it will not destroy you even at the middle of this place but this is not advisable you still have an opportunity to trade for those who are so confused but remember that there is a consolidation here please remember to avoid this once you see these opportunities you can enter the market huh you can enter the market look at this one again look at it look at these things look at it can you see that can you see that the market is for you? Boom. Look at this one. Look at this place. Boom. Do you see that? It's possible. Just, you know, if we are talking like this, some people will say, you just, uh, look, that is how you people talk. Uh, some will say, place thread, let's see. <laughs> at least I have been able to be placing thread, but I like concentrating. Remember that I am not, if I place thread, I know when to place thread and I will not lose. So if you want me to place trade for you to be convinced, I can place trade and 
I will place you do the same thing with me, you will lose. So don't be deceived that you are placing trade online. Try to get the secret, please. Try to get the secret. Do you see that? One of the things you should know is that it's not everything that you see you will trade. Look at this one also. It has something to offer to you. So this is one of the things. And one last thing you must know about this very strategy is this. Let me zoom out a little bit to show you something you will look at for. Let me zoom out a little bit to show you something you should look at for. Now look at this place. Watch this very place. This is red. This is red. Here, watch this red line. From this angle, this journey, as this thing cross over to this place, the red enter to this place. Once you see that the red is, that red has crossed below the blue line, and you see that line, red has started coming up, watch. If the red is getting far from the blue line, know it that there is an opportunity, more opportunities for next candle to be sellers. Get that, please, get that. Watch here also. Once you see this bold line, watch the blue line, the candles spaced out from this place. Not because that uh, some will think that is because of this, but watch out that the more far they are, the more um, bullish is becoming. But watch here. Now that this thing is crossing over to this place, there is an opportunity for this thing to still go down like this. Get that. But once it's spacing out, you have more opportunity. So, I mean, these are some technical observations you should know, you should do for you not to be making series of mistakes. Look at what I'm telling you. Look at here and look at this place. Can you see that? The more space, the more space you have from the line, from the moving averages, the more opportunities you expect the candle to move in the same direction. But the more closer they are coming, the more uh, suspicious it's becoming. Look at this place now. As they are coming close to this place, it's becoming so suspicious that you don't know the next candle that will come. Look at here. Do you see that now? It's becoming so suspicious. So that is why you should now add your trend lines for you to see the last place it will touch and when it will finally break out. Please be careful with this and you will not make some of these mistakes. Alright? So this is how simple this strategy can be. Um, the indicators of these videos are very simple. Please listen to me because some of you will say that I did not drop the um, strategy, the indicators. Please listen. This is MACD 12 26 9 please listen even if you didn't see it clearly please take it in words fast ema 12 magd sma 9 slow ema 26 apply to close choose any color of your choice then make the main background color do you get that do you get that now all right all right the second one is um sorry the all right this one is a uh, moving average please i'm using exponential 10 which is the right way to put it is the right way to put it is uh, 10 E M A. That is what I'm using. Then you choose the color of your choice. That is this line you are seeing below here. That is what I am using. All right. That is what I'm using. Then the one I have on the main chart is the same thing with this one I have here. That is the same thing I have here. Then this one I have is adaptive moving average. Just look for just add the moving average nine just add moving average nine you get that then you can if because if you are using android phone just add moving average nine do you get that you will get this thing just add the period nine you will get this thing okay 
that is one thing you should understand about this and you will not make a mistake about this please subscribe to my channel and i want to thank all my returning subscribers and uh, those who have been following me the challenge is starting very very soon this month and i hope that all of you will join us to make that dollar and smile home all right thank you for supporting us thank you for supporting us feel free if you are looking for a mentor please i am open for you don't think that we will deceive you we don't deceive you and we cannot do that stay tuned gdfs want to see succeed i want to see men that will call me and say thank you for your video and today i am a millionaire because i watched a video thank you for those who are writing to me already screenshotting their profits telling me the income or the impact of the videos to them i will never take you for granted you keep winning everything in life is for a prize you are paid your prize while i pay mine thank you i sign out